happening here as Buddy the Elf could tell you an elf's work that's right is never done and many elves are working hard in Newport where Christmas at the mansions is underway. New Welcome Center is being built for the breakers and Michaela is there live again this morning for a look at what's in store for visitors. Good morning Michaela. Hey, good morning. Well, you know what? All week long, we've been giving you reasons to make your way back here to the mansions because maybe the last time you were here was on a field trip or maybe when family from out of town visited years and years ago. So isn't it time you came back? There are new tours, new exhibitions, and even new construction. Check it out. We're in the caretaker's cottage right now, and this is just above the boiler room. And so this particular building is kind of the anchor point for the landscape in the front of the breakers. And as you can see, the Welcome Center is going to be completely behind a huge stand of trees, most of which are still there. So there are a lot of trees here that have been here for many, many years. But when you go into the Welcome Center, it's that wonderful entrance right there. It's going to provide ticketing indoors because mm -hmm. the Breakers is one of the last places in Newport where you have to stand outside to buy your tickets, even in the winter. So now inside ticketing, restrooms, we're going to double our restroom capacity here Good. at the Breakers and a place for refreshments. So will you show me what you have so far? Sure, let's go look. This is obviously being built. Yes. So we need to be safe about it. We this. need to do eye gear. So okay. there's that. And... Michaela's going to get her own Newport Mansions hard hat. Oh, So excellent. go ahead and slide that on. Here we go. All right. So, Michaela, watch your step as we come downstairs here. Right. And you can see what an incredible piece of work it is that's going on here. Wow. This is the actual part of the building where the ticketing is going to take place. And that green walkway, the green rebar there, they're going to pour the concrete and people will walk up into the Welcome Center through there. And on the far side is where the refreshments will be. Mm -hmm. And on the back side is where all the restrooms are going to be. It has many of the parts of the breakers, mm -hmm. design elements in it that people will recognize. Yeah. And then all of the trees here will remain. The ability to have a, an introduction to all of the mansions all at once, particularly for people who are visiting from a long way away. Yeah, you don't realize how many there are. We get people from all 48 states, all 48 contiguous states, mm -hmm. Alaska, Hawaii, and 114 countries. Wow. So people are coming here not knowing all of what there is to see. So people can take behind the scenes tours, beneath the breakers tours. They can take a combination of three houses, five houses. There's so many ways wow. to see it. So you obviously need the right team to put a place like this together. And the guys that you're seeing doing the work here on the wood and the iron are from Bean Brothers Construction. Mike Bean and his team mm -hmm. doing a fantastic job of, of really putting the pieces together on an incredible design. Yep. Alan Joslin of Epstein Joslin Architects did the design and we have been waiting years now to see it take form and here it is. When does it open? It will open in late spring. So that's what's going on outside, but inside, I mean, get a load of this. The decorations, but the rooms alone. Imagine having your holiday meal at that dining table right there. There's about uh, three dozen chairs surrounding it, too. Hope you got a big family. Speaking of holidays, when we come back, we'll give you some great gift ideas. Guys? Happening here, let's deck the halls with Holly. Sing Sweet Silent Night as well. Christmas at the Mansions continues for us here at the Roadshow. And Michaela is there live at the Breakers right now, checking out the fun to be had there this season. Good morning, Michaela. Hey, good morning once again, and nothing says fun quite like gift giving, right? If you're looking for the gift for that special someone in your life, Newport Mansions is sure to have it. Cynthia joins us once again. We saw her earlier in the week with a wonderful goodies, but you brought plenty more with you this we time. We did. We have lots of things, something for everybody. So come down and see our stores, both at Bannister's Wharf and in our mansions. Okay, great. So let's jump right in. I know okay. something that's definitely going to catch a lot of people's eyes right on their door. <laughs> that's a jingle bell wreath, and it really does jingle. It was an item we had several years ago and it just blew out so we had to bring it back mm -hmm. beautiful the inside or outside now continuing uh, with the inside if we're hosting a holiday party these are great well these are special this is an exclusive that we only have at the uh, preservation society it has the acorns on it because the vanderbilts the acorn was their symbol so mm -hmm. we always look for special items with acorns and this was actually designed for us especially in uh, mm -hmm. asia and so we're very glad to have that. Yeah, even a nice table runner, too, underneath it. And holly cool. and jolly. Very nice. <laughs> uh, what else do you have? Those acorns continue. The acorns continue. We have acorn ornaments, and we have another acorn bowl. And then we go into our beautiful angels that are here for the season to decorate your house. 
they're just elegant, beautifully done, and a really lovely accent for anybody's home. And, and a collectible for many. Absolutely. A lot of these things people are going to hang on to for generations. Absolutely. Yes, absolutely. We really enjoy that. Mm -hmm. And then down here, we actually have some pieces from Mariposa, which is one of our favorite um, manufacturers that we work with. And this is um, the Red Cardinal. Cardinals are a favorite at Christmas time. People mm -hmm. love get cardinal ornaments. And these are serving pieces with the Red Cardinal. You mentioned so, cardinal ornaments. You have more ornaments on we the have tree. More. <laughs> Well, of course, we're in Newport, and Newport's mm -hmm. about the ocean, and shells are everybody's favorite. So these are real shells. They're starfish, they're sand dollars, um, the scallop shells, and they're decorated beautifully for the holidays. Nice, and again, super affordable, a lot of different price Absolutely. ranges here. Absolutely, we really focus on that. Now, something for the little ones in the back. I can't keep my eye off of that little guy. Those are our cute jelly cats. We love them. They, it's a whole collection of different animals, and they come with their coordinating book down below, which has a little tail that sticks out. They come in different sizes. We have unicorns and cats and my, monkeys and bears. It's an absolutely wonderful collection, very cuddly. Kids just love them. Mm -hmm. So check that out at our stores. That's something kids will love, but I love candles, especially this scent. This is interesting. It's Fraser fur. It smells incredible and we sell it year round. It is so popular and especially popular at Christmas time. I, I, I'm going to go in one more time. It does. It smells like just like a Christmas <laughs> tree. Really good. We can't forget about the guys in our lives either. Absolutely. You got to think about those. So for the sailor in your family, there's plenty of um, nautical books that, that we have, ties, sailing ties. Um, it's a year-round sport. People love it. Oh, and yeah. um, so being in Newport again, we try to you know, focus on sailing mm -hmm. and the nautical theme. This has a really cool nautical tie to it. This is a wonderful thing. It's a nautical chart actually of Newport in Aquinnick Island. It's a fuzzy warm throw that you can put on on a cold night in front of the <laughs> fireplace or in front of the TV set. It's been extremely popular. It's a nautical mm -hmm. chart of the island. You can even cozy up while you're playing a game. I like that Newport Opoly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Back for the third year, that's an exclusive Newport Opoly game. And again, really popular. We sold out every year we've had it. So it's a nice pickup gift for your special person. Yes. Uh, speaking of special person, a very special guy around this time of year. Yes, Santa. We've got a bunch of Santas in different sizes, but he's particularly attractive. You know, he's just got a wonderful, happy face. He's got the list of all the people he's giving gifts to, and he's got the teddy bear for that little boy in the family. So nice. come to our stores and do shop on NewportStyle.net, which is our website, our store website. You'll see most of all these things on the website. Sounds good. Home. Excellent. So you have plenty of options if uh, this guy right here doesn't bring you everything <laughs> that you need around the holiday season. So thank you so much. Michaela, it's wonderful to be with you again. I think I'm going to go Merry home with Christmas. that candle, too. Yeah, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Christmas and Thank happy you. shopping. We'll be back with more. Absolutely. Hey, thanks, guys. You know, you may have nachos back there, but you don't have a view of the inside of the breakers like I do. And here to share more about their holiday evenings is John Rodman. Welcome back. Thank you. Now, you guys have so much going on, um, not just the decor, but other special things in a couple different mansions to really celebrate the holidays. Well, the breakers, the Elms and Marble House are the ones that are open and decorated for Christmas. And also this year, Rosecliff is going to continue with its regular exhibition. So Pierre Cardin is there. Mm -hmm. But the big treat is the holiday nights, as far as I'm concerned. Those, those Saturday nights are magical. I wait for them every year. Mm -hmm. And a lot of other people do, too, because this Saturday already sold out, but other opportunities, of course, for the public. So every other Saturday night going forward, we're going to have something going on. So this Saturday night, the second, is sold out, as you said. But we have another one a week away. That mm -hmm. Saturday is going to be at the Breakers. Then on the 19th, instead of the Breakers, we open Marble House and the Elms. And that's a special treat. That's right? a yeah. special treat. It's a single admission. You see both houses. And again, it's live choral music. We take the ropes down. It's open house, oh. refreshments, um, some for the younger people, some for us adults. Mm -hmm. So it's a lot of fun. And the interesting part about the duet is we have a free shuttle running back and forth. So oh. you only have to park once, ride back and forth. Mm -hmm. Some people tell me putting the kids on, on the trolley with Santa or whatever, yeah. that's kind of one of the highlights for yeah. them. It's like a little ride. And <laughs> a, a little ride, it's a, it's a great ride mm -hmm. between those two houses. And then we've got all kinds of live music. Yes. So. And, and so much talent there as well. So much talent. So we've got, first of all, let me see, on the uh, 30th, so we're going to do one the uh, the weekend of New Year's, mm -hmm. and that is going to be a big band event, oh, but we've also got a harpist who's going to be performing, Evelyn 
uh, Erilyn Mitchell. I need mm -hmm. to get her name right, and she's a magnificent talent. Yes. But we've got Swing on the 23rd, so all kinds of great music from mm -hmm. carols to traditional to, gosh, the stuff you can dance to. And when you take those ropes down, you grab a glass of eggnog, you're going to feel like you're part of what this house was meant for, right? And, you know, we think Alice Vanderbilt would approve because mm -hmm. this house was meant to be a showcase for enjoying life and enjoying beautiful spaces and mm -hmm. here we are in addition to the eggnog and the the shuttle ride back and forth to the mansions what else will we be able to enjoy well it's a, it's a it's a combination treat in the sense that what you have on that particular evening the duet or that's the only night those two houses are open for an evening and you've got some very different christmas decorations mm -hmm. um alex and Ani has contributed a very special piece of christmas decoration this time so we've got all kinds of new things for people to enjoy on the holiday evenings and holiday cookies, I hope. Oh, yes. <laughs> but that's a secret. I can't oh. tell you any more than that. Okay. Maybe, maybe there are holiday cookies. You'll just have to Oh, no, wait. there are. Okay, it's just, good. what are they? Hmm, yes, it's a good point. Now, what time uh, of the evening are So the holiday now? evenings are on Saturday nights, and they are 6 to 8, except for the duet night on the 19th when it's 6 to 9. So you have time to see both houses. Okay, plenty to see there, John. Thank you again so much. So another great way to celebrate the holidays, if you're going to spend it here taking a tour or a holiday evening. And don't forget, tomorrow is our last day live here at the Breakers. So stick around, we'll have plenty more.